So to solve this equation, uh, we can try solving by factoring, which will work. Uh, we'll do the bottoms up method, multiply 4 times 25, you get 100. We're going to find two numbers that multiply to be 100 but add to be negative 20. That's negative 10 and negative 10. But since we did that bottoms up trick, we have to divide by the 4 that we multiplied before. Divide by 4, divide by 4. Reduce. Both of those fractions reduce to 5 over 2. And now bottoms up. So the 2 goes in front of the x. So now that it's factored to finish solving, you tee it up, set them both equal to zero. So you get 2x equals 5, and the same thing on the other side. Divide by 2, x equals 5 over 2, which is b. You get the same answer twice, so don't worry about the other answer.